Good morning, naturally. Good morning, Wayne. Uh, it is a naturally beautiful morning out here at the Lake Metro Park Farm Parks. See, the sun comes out. Oh, da, da. Must be you, Adam. I think it might be. We're hoping for a little sunshine. Yeah, because I mean, it was the wet night. Yeah, it was. It was. It was. I was like, okay, we're going to be out here with like over 200 uh, tractors and, and farm machines. Very cool. The Historical Society. Um, you guys have been doing this show for over 50 years, right? That's correct. That's pretty cool. We're back in our hometown of Kirtland after mm -hmm. a long time of Burton, Ohio. This is our second year of Farm Park. Excellent. Over 200 uh, last year. You had over 200 vehicles, and this year That's about correct. the same ish. It's going to be about the same. Now they're still rolling in, and they'll be coming in uh, all the way through Friday morning. So now this we're is, hoping to have a great turnout. This there. is going to be one of the stars of the show. This is a steam engine. That is tractor. Correct. I mean, this is probably one of the oldest we have out here, I would assume. Yes, it actually would be the oldest that we have out here. We're the Historical Engine Society. Uh, it is a 1904 boiler on there made by uh, Case, wow. Racine, Wisconsin. So the same principles that we, we saw with the, with the steam engine trains that built the country. And I said, wait a minute, <laughs> let's make a compact version of such a thing, right? That was exactly the thinking. Uh, they used that same way of thinking to help out in agriculture to power machines that had previously either been horsepower or man driven. Unbelievable. So in terms of one that's actually working and functioning, is this pretty rare, Adam, to get one uh, of these? It is getting to be pretty rare to have them. They never made a lot. Uh, yeah. Case, I believe overall, made about 40,000 engines. Back in the they day. They were the largest producer of them. Wow. And then during the show, you'll hook that the the flywheel up to the belt that's, and then what's the fan thing that's called a baker fan okay. it's named after its inventor abner baker he's from ohio cool. it's a power testing device that they used at the factory in okay. Swanton, ohio it's actually got a calculation that goes with it to calculate huh. horsepower relative wow. to speed so basically a diagnostic back then back a, a, a diagnostic break-in yeah. device diagnostic right. tool or measuring device over here what does uh, what centuries are we talking about here and what are we looking at here adam so what we have here is a baker gas tractor okay um it was actually built by the same company that built the fan okay swanton ohio so that's a local tractor all right. uh, after things converted from steam, they went to gas, large gas tractors like this. Uh -huh. They have a couple Rumley oil pulls. Okay. Uh, they don't actually run on oil. They run on kerosene or gasoline, Interesting. but they cool with oil. Ah, wow. So a little yeah. bit different than using antifreeze. And then as we wrap up, these last two, the Hart Par and the Avery. The Hart Par and the Avery are both what we would also call prairie tractors. Okay. Um, they were mainly used for belt work, running things like the threshing machine that we see over on the other side of the grounds, or a okay. corn chopper. All right. Uh, and also, and last they could do but a little not least, work. yeah, the Avery. Okay. Yes, we have the big Avery. That's a very rare piece. Um, nice restoration on that one. Living history lessons out here at the farm park all weekend long. I mean, that's what's really cool because they'll be able to talk to you guys and you guys can basically give a history lesson and everything. Absolutely. The owners will be present with these throughout the show. Much of this stuff's going to be running. So. Love it. All right. Well, much, lots to show you guys when we come back. Tons of farm equipment. The biggest tractor show in Northeast Ohio right here at Lake Metro Park Farm Park. Stay with us.